down they're off and as they begin to settle down upon the outside uh, time charter showing very good speed in Devonair, and now it's Devonair going on from Brummondale in second place Devonair and Brummondale the two outsiders lead the Oaks in the early stages from Dione in last further and then comes uh, Swift Foot and behind Swift Foot time charter then the French challenger all along and behind that one on the near side is Caddy Ha they continue their stiff uphill climb and it's Brummondale now going on here, ridden by David Dine, his first ever ride in a classic, this one, this grey. Rummendell, the leader, from, in second place, Time, uh, time Charter. Uh, Devonair, I should say, second. Then up on the outside, Swiftfoot is third. These are then followed by Dione up on the inside and Last Feather. Then comes Kadihar on the inner. But it's Brummendell in the lead from Last Feather on the outside of Devonair. Then comes Dione in fourth and Last Feather and Kadihar on the inside. Lester Pickett on Tunts making up ground on the outer, on the outer, that is, of Time Charter. Then comes Slightly Dangerous towards the rear of this field is uh, Panadarion Zinzara. The field very closely grouped indeed at the top of the hill, where Brummendell now surrendering the lead to up on the outside. Uh, uh, up on the outside, it's cut loose. And uh, also up there is Swiftfoot. So they begin the descent into Tattenham Corner. And as they do so, the, the grey Brummondale now being passed on the outside by Swiftfoot. Then Dione making up ground and then Devonair. Then comes Last Feather. Lester Pickett on the very wide outside on Tance. Behind him is Avoir Sif. And as they begin the journey into the home straight, begin the descent to Tattenham Corner. And it's Swiftfoot in the lead from Devonair in second place. Then comes Last Feather. Then just in behind these, slightly dangerous. Leicester getting ever closer up on the outside. The French challenger is last but one. Last of all is the early leader, Brummondale. And they begin the turn into the home straight with Swiftfoot on the rails in the lead. Then Caddy Har up on the outside, Last Feather. Devonair in behind these. Then comes Dione, slightly dangerous. Uh, Willie Carson looking for ground. Time Charter comes under pressure. The pace really quickening there. They've got just over two and a half furlongs to go. And it's Last Feather in the lead. Last Feather the leader from Caddy Har in second. Then comes Slightly dangerous and time charter staying on. Lester Pickett on the wide outside under pressure and seemingly held at this stage. A furlong and a half to go in the Oaks. And it's Last Feather being tackled by stable companion. Slightly dangerous. Slightly dangerous and Last Feather. But time charter under Billy Mew just coming with a strong run down the centre of the track. Zinzara is finishing fast. Behind is Owasi. And inside the final furlong, time charter. The first classic victory inside for Billy Mew. At the line, time charter the winner. Swiftly dangerous. Slightly dangerous is second. Then came in.